I've got it narrowed down between a wilderness, a purple, and a lull, I think, right now. I'm still researching some, but that's pretty much what I've got it narrowed down to. I've also been looking on mattress.com, and I'm going to try to finalize my selection soon so we can go ahead and get that new mattress in here before we move in full time because we're going to be sleeping right here full time in about three weeks. So when I was originally going to replace this mattress, I wanted to get one that was about an inch or so longer because Tony's feet hang off. So this one says it's 60 by 74. And the one I got, I believe, is 60 by 75. So it's just going to be an inch longer, but hopefully that'll make a little bit of a difference. So, so long, mattress. Wish I could say you've been good, but you haven't. Sayonara. We're putting our new mattress in. <laughs> Made in the USA. America. And we have pillows too. So here's what it looks like without the mattress. All looks big. <laughs> we don't have much storage room under, under the bed. So yeah, everything looks good. Always look at stuff when you change stuff around to make sure, you know, you don't see anything awry like mold or, you know, water damage or just anything. You just never know what you might find. So always check things out. Here's how it comes rolled up. I mean, this is tight, tightly packaged in this plastic roll here. Well, I can't wait to see how this thing feels. You can see the spring coils through the plastic here. I know that it's some type of hybrid mattress. It has the spring coils and the gel foam layers. Do we need scissors? Not yet. It's like Christmas trying to get this. Oh, 
Oh, I hear it sizzling. Hang on. Got it's an air leak. It's coming open, folks. <laughs> Which side oh, this is an organic cotton uh, topper. That. It's a cotton topper, yeah. So that's up. But is there a front and a back? Um, or a t it. head and a tail? <laughs> Okay, so I guess it does go this way. Well, no, this one would be, this one's upside down, so you can't go by that. Well, it looks good to me. If we have to turn it around, we have to turn it around. All right, so let's do it. Now let me see the scissors. Let's see if we can't strategically stay away from it. There's another layer of gray there, I see, too. Here you go. Here it goes. Here she blows. Woo, looky there. Oh my gosh. It feels really soft, you guys. Oh my gosh, feel it, Tony. Yeah. What does Tony think? Oh, it's already puffed up. <laughs> yeah, it's already puffed up. <laughs> they said you can sleep on it in 15 to 20 minutes, but they said the corners might take longer like uh, up to 24 yeah, hours and yeah look this corner is wrinkled here guys so i can the rest of it looks good but the the corners are still a little wrinkly i guess they go through more of the compression or something well does it feel comfy Six hundred dollars comfy. What? <laughs> Six hundred dollars. You didn't know the cost of it. But like you said, we're moving in here, so. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Hey, it's a good size. It it does hang over like one more inch, so maybe your legs will be just a hair better. Yeah, it fits still, good. Still good here. So. Yeah. yeah. It's just one inch longer, which isn't a whole lot, so we'll see. There she blows. Yeah, there she blows, folks. Ta-da! Ah, let's try it out. Oh, it's really soft. The top. Yeah, it's soft. I don't feel like I'm like sinking all the way to the bottom board anymore. Good night. Gotta get our pillows open. That mattress looks really nice. I like it. So far, so good. I need to get some new sheets though, guys. I still have all my old sheets. Can I buy $600 sheets too, Tony? Um, $6. Well, I guess I'll go to the family dollar and <laughs> get the hard ones. Ooh. Let me see that. Ooh, I like the gray. It's nice. So all of this came together. So I ordered it online and it came at the same time in two separate boxes. <gasps> let me feel, let me feel, let me feel. Oh, yeah. Nice foam pillow. It says shredded foam. It sounds it's like a, a my pillow. It's a minced up my it's pillow. A my, it's a my pillow, but a, a little bit nicer. But. What do you think about the new mattress? I ain't slept on it. It's yeah, we yeah. need to sleep on it. We will come back in a few weekends and let you know how our first night is. We are actually boondocking at the farm this weekend. Look, right out that window is a bulldozer. <laughs> it's currently broke down. It has a hydraulic leak. Out this window is a nice dirt pile. There you go. That's why, if you look at my hair, it's just a mess, because I just put it up. Wow, it looks nice. 
Tony said it was too plush on first, you know, just sitting on it, so we'll see. <laughs> I think he's just used to the other hard one. fell asleep there. Where are you going, Zero? <laughs> Zero likes the new mattress. One of us has already fallen asleep. <laughs> well, we've had our new Montana hybrid wilderness plush mattress for about three months now. So I was just uh, doing a follow-up to let you know how much we enjoy it. Do you like it, Tony? Yeah, it's very comfy. <laughs> I honestly don't have any complaints about it. I mean, I think it was worth the money. It's way better than that thing we had on there before. <laughs> it's good and plush with the pillow top, cotton pillow top that it has on there. And... Just don't have any complaints about it. It's I get a good night's sleep. I don't wake up with my hips or shoulders hurting anymore. So, hey, all you can ask for is a good night's sleep, right? Uh, a couple things I did want to mention. Uh, we are not affiliated with the Wilderness Company whatsoever. We just need a new mattress, so we bought one. Uh, I did want to call them to check on a few things. Uh, so I did call their customer service line um, before I bought a mattress. And I, when I was in the researching stages and I just wanted to kind of find out how their customer service was and that kind of give you an idea <laughs> of how the company is. And I did have some uh, legitimate questions for them as well. So the three questions that I asked, um, when I called, I had to leave a message. So I didn't really care for that a whole lot. You, you can't reach a live person. At least the hours that I called was like in the middle of the day during the week. Um, and I had to leave a message and they said that they would call me back and they did. Um, it was within like an hour and a half. I did receive a call back, um, from a gentleman who was extremely nice. And my questions to him were, first of all, is there any way that I could get a discount <laughs> if I bought a mattress? And he actually gave me a 5% discount code to use when I order online. Um, so I did get to save 5%. And the other thing was I wanted to know if I needed one of those mattress barriers that you see a lot of RVers use. Um, a pretty, uh, those seem to be pretty popular and a lot of people are using those. Uh, it keeps the moisture down between the board and the mattress. And I know sometimes mold can, or fungus, types of fungus can build up in there. So uh, he said that they don't even sell those and that they're not recommended with their mattresses. So he basically said, you don't even need that. So I'm like, cool, because I didn't want to spend any extra money anyway. So, and so far so good. And then the third thing was, uh, I wanted to know if they had any type of financing because I like to, uh, you know, d to pay it monthly. Um, especially if you have a lot of other bills going on. And they did have through a company called Klarna, K-L-A-R-N-A. It's on their website. Uh, you can get six months, same as cash. So that's what I did. I'm just paying monthly. I'm going to pay it off in six months. So I won't have to pay any interest or anything like that. So, and again, uh, they were really nice. The company, uh, is here in the U S all their products are made here in the U S and what else? Uh, for any details or if you want to link to their website, 
be down in this description below. Um, we don't have any discount codes to offer anything like that because like I said, we're not affiliated with them. We just need a new mattress. So if you want to get your own 5%, I would recommend just giving them a call or maybe research online and you can find one that way. Um, the company does have good reviews. That's one of the reasons that I did pick them. Um, on their website, I believe they had like 4.5 or 6 stars. Um, that's one of the things I did when I was researching. I read the reviews <laughs> and if they only have uh, one or two negative reviews and all the rest positive, then, then that's a good sign. That's kind of one of the things that I look for. And then I read the reviews as well. Um, so the reason I went with the wilderness is because they are in the U S uh, they ship to you for free and they are, specifically an RV mattress company. Um, they do custom orders as well. Um, we didn't need a custom one, but uh, some, some RVs have those odd shapes and no Airstreams or one. If I had to say anything at all, I would say that the edges, if you roll over and you're on the very edge, it doesn't quite feel as supportive as you know when you get further in inside the mattress so but other than that i mean it's great it's very comfy and the pillow top it did take us a little bit of time to get used to it because we're used to a more firm mattress i would say just a few days and then we pretty much sleep like a baby <laughs> so but anyway what about the pillows the pillows uh i don't know I wouldn't. You don't use yours. I use mine. Yeah. I, it took me a while to get used to it. I actually had tried a my pillow before, and they're similar to those. I did not like the my pillow. This one seemed to be a little more comfy. Um, it is the the shredded foam pillow, but it feels more like a gel kind of pillow to me. So I don't know. Um, but it seemed like it hurt my neck at first. I, I've never slept you know, on a pillow quite like that before. So I don't know. Maybe it's too luxurious for me or something. I'm not sure, but. Um, most of the time I just put it between my legs and use it that way, but Tony likes his. So to each his own, everyone's different. But anyway, uh, that is going to wrap it up for this, uh, mattress video. So if you guys have a mattress that you like, leave a comment below and let us know about it and how you like it, the name of it and how long you've had it. And that might help some of the, the other YouTube watchers to to let them know if they're looking for a mattress as well. But other other than that, do your own research and uh, see what's out there. I'm sure there's lots of other ones that are just as nice. So we appreciate you guys watching. We'll catch you next time. Time to go to bed. Good night. Thank <laughs> you.